Good day. It's great to have you watching Kasgurt News with you, Aisla Armatova. Today we have a special guest from U.S. Consul General Amata. Good day, Mr. Chas. Hi, Aislu. Thank you for having me. It's great to be in Kasgurt. Yeah. We are glad to see you uh, in Kasgurt, especially at Kasgurt News. We have heard that you are leaving Kazakhstan in August. Can you tell about uh, one of the successful projects uh, have done uh, by your department since you came to Kazakhstan? Sure, I salute. And but first, I just wanted to say thank you for having me in your really amazing studio. Uh, we're really, really impressed with everything that we've seen with Kazgort News. Uh, the student journalists are really, really, really impressive, and uh, this is one of the best startup journalism operations that I've really seen. So I would say that this is actually one of the most impressive things that I've seen during my three years in Kazakhstan on this assignment. Uh, there's a lot of really exciting things happening in Kazgurt. Um, the students that are here for the English Language Access Program are doing a great job promoting tourism, um, promoting a positive image of Kazgurt, showing the beautiful nature, um, showing the hospitality of this great area to a lot of new guests. So I want to really commend um, the Access Program and the students that started up this uh, Kazgurt Journalism Association. It's been really great to see, so congratulations. Thanks. Are you planning to organize something, uh, kind of uh, festival or concert in South Kazakhstan or Kazgurt? That's because, a great question. Yeah, because we know that you organized uh, a lot of festivals, concerts. Mm -hmm. So this year in March, uh, we had an American uh, musician performing in Shimkent along with um, uh, some Kazakhstani um, actors and, and musicians. Aisulu Eisenbaeva and Chinggis Kapin performed along with an American saxophonist. So that was this year in March. Last year, we had a big ballet concert. Um, American Ballet Dancers Island Moving Company performed with Kazakhstan Samruk Dance Company. I hope that we can have another performance in Shimkent or Kazgurt really soon and we'll definitely let everybody know so that we can invite you to attend. Uh, we always have ongoing activities at our American corner in Shimkent and of course here in Kazgurt we have our access program which is always organizing really great activities around town. So we always want to do more because we really like Kazgurt and Shimkent uh, and we'll try to do more in, Sh in South Kazakhstan and let everybody know about it. Okay, what do you think about Kazgurt's perspective? Kazgurt's beautiful. The people are wonderful. The food is delicious. The nature is amazing. So I think that there's great perspectives and I would just encourage everybody to find new ways to bring people here to show them uh, culture, show them um, the nature. Because uh, a lot of people when they come to Kazakhstan, uh, they really want to experience local culture. They want to experience local food. They want to experience tradition. But in Almaty and in Shimkent, big cities, uh, it's city life. You don't see as much of the real culture, the real kind of uh, agricultural experience and, and local food and food made on a big kazan and things like that. So that's something that Kazgurt really has um, that, that it can show people and it can help promote tourism here. Also, there's, of course, a lot of opportunity for business and trade uh, between Kazakhstan and its neighbors through this area. So... A lot of really great positive things are happening and it's wonderful. There's so many students now through the Access Program that are learning really great English that are able to help build partnerships. Thank you for your interview. Thank you for your coming. Yeah, thank you very much, Aisalu, and good luck to everybody in Kazgurt.